Enzio, welcome to Eastleigh. Let's start by talking about your youth career. You began your career at SC Vorland before joining Utrecht. Talk us through that period for you. Oh yeah, first of all, thank you for, for the warm welcome. Um, yeah, I started um, playing football when I was five years old at um, SC Vorland. Um, after that, I moved to Almira, where I played for the local team there. Um, you know, in the youth teams, I always um, you know, score a lot of goals and they asked me to, to play with my, uh, you know, the best uh, players in the, of my group age. Um, but I always wanted to play with my friends, so, you know, in the season I've scored maybe 40, 50 goals and, you know, um, that gave me the, the transfer to FC Utrecht. In 2012, you went on loan to Den Bosch before making a permanent move to Almere City in 2013. You spent three years there and made 93 appearances in that time. How did you find your time at Almere City? Um, yeah, I think um, I learned a lot during that time, you know, going from um, academy level to, to first team football. Um, you know, I had to adapt a lot. Um, I think I was at that time a little bit shy um, at the time, but, you know, looking back, if I... Uh, if I was more like aggressive, um, you know, I could have got more of my time uh, out there. The next stage of your career saw you come to England, more specifically Crawley Town. How did that move to England come about? Um, I had a very strong uh, season at the time at Almere City. Um, I think we we got beat in the the final of the playoffs, um, and the director of football of Crawley um, contacted me and um, basically asked um, if I could have a look at the club and see if I like like it and come and play for them. Um, and yeah, that's what I decided to do. Yeah. Moving country can be a difficult experience, especially at the age of 24, which you were. How did you find that transition? It was, it was actually good. Um, you know, I came here alone, but um, you know, they made me feel welcome. Um, and um, yeah, quickly I adapted to the style of play and um, yeah, really enjoyed my time. Whilst at Crawley, you made your debut in a 1-0 win against Wickham Wanderers and just three days later, you scored your first goal for Crawley against Wolves in the EFL Cup. What was that experience like? Yeah, I still think about it this day. Um, you know, it was a header as well, which I haven't scored many in my career. Um, but yeah, the stadium and uh, the whole occasion was, was really special, yeah. 2018 saw you complete a move to Notts County where you went on to make 112 appearances. How did you find your time in Nottingham? Challenging at, at, at first. Um, you know, I, I loved going there. Um, you know, they, um, uh, they were a big club. And um, yeah, I loved playing for them because, you, you know, the expectation and, and, and the size of the club was all good. Like it fits um, the style I wanted to play. Um, but, you know, we, we got relegated in the first season, um, which, which was hard. Um, but I think the two seasons after, um, yeah, we had some good seasons where we ended up in the playoffs, but fortunately we didn't make it in the end. Most recently, you spent time at Sutton United making 84 appearances. How was that? Yeah, also uh, it was a different experience for me, um, you know, coming back to London, which was good. Um, you know, meeting up with um, Matt Gray there. And um, yeah, I'm just fortunate that I could play a lot of games and uh, in different positions as well. Um, you know, made me the player I am today. Like I've learned a lot. Um, so yeah, hopefully I can, um, you know, continue this over here. You join us with a wealth of experience. What can our supporters expect to see from you as a player? Um, I'm a, a player that has a lot of pace. Um, I like to go one on one with uh, with defenders. Um, I have a, a good shot on me, um, good cross. So yeah, hopefully, um, you know, I can get some goals and assists, um, which I've missed in the past few seasons. I can add them to this team and be uh, be important here. And just finally, how excited are you to get started? Oh yeah, very much. Um, you know, this um, the whole project the team is in. Um, you know, just missing out on the playoffs last season and and uh, the way the team wants to go and. Also, with my personal, um, you know, situation, I have a, a little girl coming soon, and um, you know, I wanted to be closer to the family um, with the support of my fiance as well. So, not everything fits at the moment, and I'm, uh, you know, so happy to be here. And yeah, welcome to Eastleigh. Thank you very much.